The remains of a crocodile 17 million years ago were found. Debris has been found in the Belchato mine in Poland crocodile from about 17 million years ago. They come from the Miocene era the last one warm and humid in the history of the earth, conducive to lush occurrence vegetation and various species of animals. Discoveries in the area of the Szczecin mine Belchato mine in the area of Zacherka researchers from the Faculty of Geology and the Faculty of Biology of the University Warsaw, Institute of Paleobiology PA and Polish Academy of Sciences Museum of the Earth and Moravian the Earth Museum, Czech Republic. We were looking for vertebrate remains and it was the only one the fragment that we were able to find. At first it was reminiscent of the ordinary a piece of bone. It wasn't until we made him up and watched his other one, a very characteristic side, there was no doubt that it is shallow skin crocodile, or osteoderm said CO discoverer, Dr. Marcin Gorka from Department of Geology of the University of Warsaw. Analysis of sources shows that it is the northernmost delays of a crocodile from a period of 23 million years. At this time from the Miocene after the Quaternity there was no crocodile position further north. Older, because crayfish crocodiles are known from Sweden, and from the period of Paleogene also from Denmark and the Canadian Arctic. The remains found in the Belchato mine come from the Aram Miocene, 23 million to 5.3 million years ago, the last so warm and humid in the history of the Earth. Especially early and middle Miocene was particularly marked high temperatures, so-called Miocene Climatic Optimum. Because in the Miocene the climate was about 3 to 4 degrees warmer than he is currently, at least that is estimated, and the humidity was greater. This made it very lush in these conditions all the vegetation developed from the remains of which coal deposits were created the brown ones. The climate also helped the occurrence of various species of animals sea and land. The remains of the latter meet in a particularly large number in karst and lake settlements, the researcher described. Miocene was also characterized by significant tectonic activity, it is mainly marked in the area of southern and central Poland. In many places were created with tectonic sinks, often filled with water. Yes the built reservoirs, lakes, marshes favored the development of vegetation, but it was also a kind of trap for all plant and animal matter that they do it came in and which we can discover today said Gorka. Among animals, crocodiles deserve special attention typical for subtropical and tropical areas. In the early and middle the Miocene Central Europe was a habitat for two different types crocodile, Gaviolosuchus and Diplocinodon. This one the first was a sea type whose total body length exceeded six, memois. The second crocodile was Diplocinodon, endemic type, usually fresh water, reaching 1.5 to 3 meters. The tile found by us does not have 100% characteristics that could have been testifying, the kind of thing we are dealing with. However, however, most likely it was the extinct Diplocinodon a relative of modern's alligators. We think so because just like modern alligators had a bigger one tolerance to the cold, that is, it could have occurred more north, doctor the mountain. It is not easy to find such a tiny, approximate 30 mm fragment on such a large excavation. It is almost as much as during mushroom picking. What of this, someone's walking in the woods, how aren't there? You have to be lucky. But but you also need to know what you are looking for, so as not to throw yourself at everything, the eye was a little sensitive admitted Dr. Gorka. He added that working in the mine grounds requires a lot of mindfulness. Visits in the mine are always associated with the threat. 
We are aware that for employees and management, we are a burden. They have to take care of our safety, and by the way, we distract them from their duties. So we are extremely grateful for allowing us this work emphasized the geologist from the University of Warsaw. The work published by a Polish-Czech team of researchers presents several previous finds of crocodile remains from the Czech Republic and the United Kingdom. The described material also includes an archival tooth find crocodile from shallow water sea sediments from Pincho. This tooth was discovered by Professor Andrei Radvonsky in the 60s 70s. The 20th century. Another one of the presented the remains are a tooth from Czech, Idlakovic, about 14 million years ago. It comes from collection of Professor Anton Mzahaka, but has never been mentioned in any of the his work, although on the handwritten label the researcher correctly he identified it as a crocodile tooth. The discovery is described in an article in the journal Acta Paleontologic Polo NICA.